right, so we back. Listen, guys, I get this question a lot, and I just want to remind everyone that I am still a student of the game as well. I don't really know what's going to be the best method for each and every one of you guys in terms of your own art journey. That's kind of up to your discretion to figure that out. However, I know that, you know, a lot of folks ask this question on the channel and um, I'll go ahead and give the best answer I can <laughs> and I hope it helps someone out there. Um, but the question is, how do I get started with this art stuff when I, you know, have literally no idea? Yeah, I've, I've, I have no experience, essentially, right? Um, I'm going to keep it a stack, man. If you have no idea, like at all, I really want you to ask yourself this question, right? Ask yourself, okay, why do I want to draw in the first place? Why do I want to draw in the first place? Because the reason why I wanted to draw in the first place was originally to uh, become the super great concept artists like Tetsuya Nomura and Shigenori Soejima, right? I wanted to draw like really, really cool anime shit. And I just love doing it just to do it, man. I did it during class. I did it at home. My mom wouldn't let me uh, play video games for more than an hour every uh, week, man. So it's like I had nothing but time on my hands as a kid. So it's like I had to kill the time somehow. So I started drawing and it just became a fun pastime, right? And it's stuff like that that like really solidified. Okay, I just do this to, to, to de-stress, to have fun, to relax. And I think that's a very, very important component to this art journey thing, you know, learning how to enjoy it outside of like just the improvement piece. That's always going to be a factor of it. You know, everyone's going to want to improve at this art stuff. And that that's definitely, you know, you, you could definitely uh, 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 target that. But I think if you have literally no idea where to start at all, I would say focus on the enjoyment level first. Um, that for me helped me streamline what exactly I even wanted to do with art to begin with, bruh. Like, I remember as a kid, I would draw cars, I would draw swords, I would draw screenshots from video games, or not screenshots, I guess you could say like screen captures in, in my, my mind, because I didn't have no phone back then, from games that I liked, uh, like Naruto Ultimate Ninja 2, or Gran Turismo 4, I, I would draw screen caps of those, and I would be so like hype, because I couldn't play the game, so it's like, well, let me just, you, you know, this is the next best thing, you know? And stuff like that though, you know what I'm saying? It's just enjoyment. Like I wasn't focused on getting better, but it's like once I started doing that a lot, I started establishing goals for myself. Once I realized kind of like where I was skill level wise at the age of like 10, oh my God. <laughs> right? Um, so I was like, dang man, my shit kind of not that good. So like, let me, you know, instead, work on something like let me work on you know getting the face right like for me i, I super focused on the face because like all right man my face is trash let me, let me get this face right you feel me you like like that's how i was like you know kind of tackling it as a little 10 year old snot ass kid man because it's like for me that was like you know this like like if i can get the face right then that, i can capture the emotion right you know and i still didn't like capture the you face right as a kid but like that was the face, point man. that like you know it's I, I established a goal because i started just drawing for fun and it's like i slowly started realizing okay wait i see this about my art let me try and change this you know so that's like my my, my thing I, that i think could apply to even an adult artist an adult beginner artist is like you know why did you want to start drawing you want to go professional that's a different thing altogether right um because in which case yeah you'd have to kind of buckle down and learn you know some um some, like the anatomy and the basics and the fundamentals in which that case i would advise you to pick up an anatomy book i'm using burn hoggers dynamic anatomy i would either do that or purchase maybe a class from mark brunette or proco of some sort because if you're super serious about going like professional with it and you don't want to like waste any time then i would just like go straight to the source i i don't have no class i'm still learning too so i cannot be the one to you know i guess give you guidance as good as those guys could right i'd say go there first and then like pick up like maybe their their classes that where, where they're tackling the subject matter the anatomy or the fundamentals of, of art they'll have a really good structured baseline for how to improve specifically and you're gonna see results too and then as long as you're keeping up with your you, you know your studies as long as you're keeping up with you know the art on the side just like you know to to, to, to de-stress from the actual studies too you're gonna see the results man so that's what i'd say it depends on your goals it's a really hard question to answer when you don't have the context of someone's life which is why it's like uh, every time I, I i see the question i try to answer as best as i can but it's like i know i can't really provide too much of an insight because it's like bruh I, I i don't know you i mean i wish i did you're, you're you guys are lovely people but like I, I don't i don't know you man so either way um that was just kind of my take on all of this again uh take it with a grain of salt you know i just think you know again the, the enjoyment piece is a really underrated piece man take that to heart if anything um i think art 
it, it's it's super beautiful. You 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 express yourself. You know, you, it's all about expression, human expression, and you know that you know you, you you don't you don't capture that without enjoying it. You know, so. I think the enjoyment piece is, you know, the first part I'd start with. And then after that, you kind of start to realize certain things that you, you can work on. And then from there, that's when you can really hit the ground running. So hope this helps someone out there. Maybe it didn't, man. I'm always rambling on here, bro. I'm going I'm to I'm script my videos one day, man. <laughs> I'm going to script them one day. But anyways, that's kind of it for me. Leave a like or comment if you enjoyed this video. Studies will be posted, as always, on Sunday. Follow my Instagram at chrismason underscore one Bing Bond Prison Palace updates are coming soon. And yeah, man, we're going to go ahead and get up out. Appreciate y'all. I'm hop off. Peace.